Hi guys, Frugal Gal here. Let's have a cuppa, meaning a cup of tea, hot tea, and open some roaches. Mm, that's good. Okay. I ordered some, as you guys know, if you're familiar with my channel, what was it, last week? Yeah, last, yeah, a week ago, I got into a frazzled mood and I had an auction late at night and I sold off all my brooches, so I'm having to replenish the stock. So I won some off eBay. They actually took, anytime I look at eBay and if they have a listing on there for anything that they say or make an offer, I always make an offer. And the person accepted my offer, so I got these really reasonable. By the way, just a little frugal tip for you. If you, look, I got bonus hairs with it. It was like in the tape where they taped it. So, I got somebody's DNA. So, um, anyway, I have just a frugal little tip. If you want some really good scissors, and I use these, I buy several pairs of these, and I use one in my kitchen for um, food prep, and then I keep these on my table in my um, little thing with my pens and pencils and stuff. But these are Betty Crocker scissors, and you get these at Dollar Tree, of course, for a buck. Go buy you a bunch of these. These are really good scissors. Just a little frugal tip. Like, I should have that shooting star on the more you know. But let's see what we got shall we oh where's loop de loo i had loop de loo oh i left did i leave loop de loo somewhere i must have not brought him over ow not brought loop de loo over there sorry that hurt okay they, well, they packed it good they packed it in a box that i can reuse so that's always good they didn't tape the box though so how do i get the box open i'm asking you like you know okay so it's in a box i'm gonna go get loop de loo sorry just stare at the box for a minute I could stop the video, but oh yeah, I left it over on the countertop while I was making my tea. All right, here's loop de loop. All right, do to do. So it looks like they wrapped them good, and it was just a lot. I can't remember. It didn't list how many there was. I mean, you could count them in the picture, but uh, I got like these because people, you guys are asking me for silver tone stuff, so there was some silver tone in there, and I really wanted to get them. See, here's the silver tone. For you guys who have been asking for silver tone brooches. Because I have to admit, the most things I find are in gold tone. So let's get you down here. It's a really pretty... Almost looks like a fern, doesn't it? Like a fern flower. And I'm pretty sure some of these said they were signed. This one does not appear to be signed. It almost reminded me of a Sarah Coventry. I thought it was one. But it does not appear to be signed. But it, isn't that pretty? It's all silver. So somebody like that. And that's that's might be coming off on the screen as gold tone. But it's not. That middle part is, as far as I can tell, so maybe it is gold tone. No, I think it's silver tone. All silver tone. But it's really pretty. And then this was interesting. This little bow. But it's different, like, wrapped bow instead of just the traditional bow. And this is not marked either, but it's an excellent shape. Really like that one too. Okay, so let's see about the other ones. Oh, this one fell out. I've had one similar to this. This is gold tone. The faux pearl, which I assume is a faux pearl, is in there in prong setting. It is not signed either, but it's an excellent shape. Very clean too. I'm impressed. I will buy from these people again. Okay, here's a bunch. Here's a silver tone one that um, has rhinestones on it too and faux pearls. Very pretty. Also not signed. But in great working order. Really like that. I thought this was cute because I have some people who really like horses so that's another reason why I like this lot because it had two, oh this is cute, two um, horse brooches. Look at this one, that one's probably supposed to be like it. Look at this, it's like a baby horse and look at its tail. It's got a little thing on it for its tail, like faux pearl tail. I know somebody's going to watch this video and say, I want that. Because I have a couple ladies who like um, horses. And this one probably should have the thing on the tail too, but it doesn't. But it's still really cool. I like it and they're not marked either but they're really neat okay now what else do I have there was just this little bar brooch in there and it's like mother of pearl sorry about that squeaking noise that's my table 
I changed out my table and put the camper table back on in here. So when I lean on it, it squeaks and I notice it's showing up on my videos. So that's just a cool little one. And I got the dreaded circle ones. I've had so many of these circle ones, but I had to take the lot. So they're, because I wanted the other ones, I thought, eh, I'll put up with the circle ones. But I know there's going to be some more circle ones in here. Hey, you got to replenish your brooches, right? Look at this one. This neat looking. Oh, quit squeaking. I'm talking to the table. I'm putting pretty bad. This is silver tone. You can't really tell. It's coming off on the camera like it's black metal, but it's not. It is silver tone. Maybe if I get close, you guys can see. See how it's silver? Here, let me... There. It is silver tone. And then that is not a faux pearl. That is just like a glass bead in there. It is a C clasp. That is neat. I like that. Then a couple more circle brooches. Now this one is different because this circle brooch, I don't know if somebody's, I'm out of focus. Somebody put on this little kiss lips on there because I've never seen that before on there. And then there's another one. I've had this one several times. Either one of them are signed. Oh, this one, the swan one. Isn't that swan one neat? It's got these little circles on it like mother of pearl circles. And that's gold tone. So actually, none of these are signed, but still, they don't always have to be signed to make your money back out of them. really like this one. Just seems like that should be one that should be signed, but it's really neat looking. Now that I look at it, maybe that is gold, and then that's gold there. I can't really tell what the light bouncing off of it. So let's see how many we got. I'm going to move you closer. Get this table. Quit squeaking. So one, two. Do you tell them I'm arranging them in order of size? Yeah, I am that, I am that, um, I won't use a bad word for it. I am that finicky? No. OCD? I don't know. It's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we got twelve brooches. I think they're really neat. I like them and I got them for a really reasonable price. I was surprised that they, they took my best offer. So I will go back. I'm impressed with this seller and that's what I do. I will go back and check out more of their listings. Um, and they were really fast on shipping and reasonable priced. Good people. And it's me and my cup of, and the Snoopy cup. Of course I gotta have a Snoopy cup. I didn't let my tea bag soak long enough. Mmm. I love hot tea. Okay. So that's it, guys. So you'll be seeing these in some of my upcoming auctions. A little horsey. But -dum, but -dum, but -dum, but -dum. It's, it's baby horse. I can't separate them. they got to be together, mommy and baby. They almost look like giraffes, but they're horses, right? But -dum, but -dum, but -dum. All right, guys, I'll let you go. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you want to. Remember, um, my email is right down below if you'd like to send me a little note. Also, I have a P.O. box. You can send me cards or any kind of letters. I like to have pen pals, so I'm old-fashioned that way. Thumbs up. I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.